Okay, just got my Dolby Vision update for my AWOL Vision 3500. Um, I don't know how they plan on making the picture look any better. I really don't. If it does look better, good on them because I've never seen anything that looks as fucking good as mine and everyone knows me. I am one particular bastard, okay? I will shred your fucking product into little pieces. If there's something wrong with it, are you going to screw consumers over? Are you going to lie to us? I'm going to shred you to pieces, okay? And I have found things with the AWOL Vision Projector that I would like to change, but I found nothing that would make me buy from someone else. When I see the picture, every time I turn my projector on, I'll tell you the most amazing thing. The, the lead-in for Formula One, where they show all the drivers and the colors for their cars. My friends are sitting here just like this. Just blown away because they have to look at regular TVs. So yeah, almost all of them are buying projectors this year. I have over 20 people that I know for sure that have already committed to buying the AWOL Vision Projector. But AWOL kind of fucked up. They just came out with a new line of pros. And they're like, well, what? I mean, should I wait? Am I gonna buy? Am I gonna buy a projector that's gonna be outdated? And I, I told them, I said, look, if there's gonna be an update, they'll probably update all of them. I don't think they're gonna screw any of their customers over. But these guys are very cautious because they saw what I went through with my first projector, which had many problems. So, yeah, <laughs> it just updated. I just got the new Dolby update, and I'm looking at my screensaver for my Roku. The fish tank right number one you can't see any of the colors I'm seeing because my phone can't recreate them but I am noticing it is smoother you see I could always tell the fishtails being very clear and moving like this you could see the stutter the stuttering and that appears to be gone. Fucking good on you, AWOL Vision. Good on you. It looks smoother. Good on you, man. Good on you. Wow. Yeah. Let me, let me see, put my glass on, make sure I'm not seeing something I'm not seeing here. Nope, it definitely is a bit of an improvement. Why it does that, I don't know. <sighs> I love my AWOL vision projector. <laughs> this is a main part of my hobby because I'm 100% I'm disabled. I'm stuck in this fucking chair. And that is my escape window into non-reality, into other worlds, okay? With gaming, uh, Gran Turismo, my sim rigs. This, that's my, this is my escape window into another world and is why I did so much research and saving and everything to make sure that I got the right unit. I tell you, it's, it's still, it, to this day, I've had it for quite a few months now. I'm still fucking blown away at how amazing it is. When I turn it on, I'm just like, wow, that is so bright. It lights up my whole room. You know what I mean? I mean, right now the light you're seeing, that's from my projector on the on the on the fish tank. Let alone a scene like in the middle of the day when you're watching a movie that's filmed in daylight. I mean, sometimes it's almost almost too bright. And you won't hear many projector owners complaining about their projectors being too bright, okay? If you're going to consider a projector, which I suggest you do, okay? Get the AWOL Vision. This is one of the very few products that even with some issues and problems that, that I, I want them to fix, the performance, the outright performance, okay? You got the, the fastest runner in the world. Nobody can touch the guy, but he's a fucking dickhead. You know, what do you want? A fast runner or a great personality? Well, I want the, I, I'm voting for the, and I'm betting for, and I'm rooting for the fastest runner in the world because he runs fast, not because he's a dickhead off the track. That's kind of how, how the AWOL is. There's a few things I don't like about it, but there's, it's the best projector there is, period. Now, all these other manufacturers can claim to have be more bright, more colors, okay? It's bullshit. 
one of the few things that still work on me is my eyes <laughs> and my ears. I can hear and I can still see pretty damn good, especially with my corrective lenses, okay? Because I don't have bad vision, I just have astigmatism. Outstanding, out fucking standing. It's, it definitely made things look smoother, better. I'm gonna have to play, I'm gonna have to do some gaming today and see if it's transferred over to that or maybe a 3D movie. But I can tell you when I plug in a 3D movie and I'm, and I'm watching it, as far as I'm concerned, you can't make an improvement to it. It is so just awesomely fucking beautiful badass. There's just no way I can make an improvement. Don't spend $3,000 on a big TV. Don't do it, okay? Samsung, so all Sony, Panasonic, all these people are gonna try to sell you an 85 inch TV for $3,500, okay? And I can tell you that you can get a 120 inch TV for the same price by buying an AMOL vision projector. It will be as bright, it will be more colorful, it will be, the blacks that they get have amazed me because I'm like, okay, how the hell do I get, see that fish, see that? Yellow fish with the black. See the angel fish with the black? Right? The black that shows on these fish is black, 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 black. How the hell do they do that when my fucking screen is gray? It's almost like magic. <laughs> I know it has to do with refraction, but my God. Uh, as far as the picture goes, nobody can touch a wall vision, nobody. And now that I got this Dolby update, even more of an improvement. Oh uh, yeah, it's gonna be a good day today.